as he got to the basement, he saw what Anton had done to Les Phillips. He had no choice but to bury Les Phillips in his backyard, for he couldn't go to the police, for they were looking for him. And he seems complicit due to the fact that when he found Anton, instead of taking him to the police, he kept him in his basement for his own personal reasons. The police were invited by the bar manager Jesse, who had information on Les Phillips, but wanted to bargain some personal deal before giving them anything but Nora was having none of it as she forced the information out of him in which he told her that Les Phillips was boasting to him that he had come into some money and that he called Lenny Griffith's house a couple of times like he had something on him. Anton made it known to Lenny that he was surprised that Lenny took Les Phillips death so well and how he didn't go into a frenzy but Lenny let him know that nothing matters to him but his son's life and that he was the antidote to his son surviving for he realized that Anton heals very fast and he knows that he was immune to all diseases and sicknesses that it explained why Anton had been existing for two centuries and as much as he tries to persuade him or threaten him Anton was going nowhere until he kills his son by infecting him with his werewolf blood or werewolf bite leaving Anton tied up in the basement he went straight to pick up his son in the hospital and very aware that Nora and the police were looking for him so he needed a distraction for the police were guiding his son's room under the order of Nora and Shay the nanny was with his son so Shay heard that there was someone looking for her at the reception on her way she was confronted by Lenny Griffith who convinced her to help him distract the police so he could take his son with him at first she was reluctant but because she she knows Lenny too well not to hurt a fly she succumbed to his request as she came back she told the police she saw someone that looks like Lenny downstairs the police left Jaren's room to look for Lenny and with that Lenny took the advantage of the distraction created by Shay he went into his son's room and took his son with him to his house at the basement getting information that her nephew had been taken from the hospital by his father she swerved and turned her car around heading towards Lenny's house then she called it in by asking for assistance from all her deputies to go straight to Lenny Griffith's house and to put him on a no-fly list for he was the main suspect for these murders because he fits the profile and they found his championship ring around the scene of the murder it was the night the moon was at its fullest and Anton was transforming fully into a werewolf as Lenny brought his son forward towards him the police were on their way Lenny was desperate for his son's life the police arrived Lenny's house as Nora was calling him to come out with his hands up but what they got in reply was a howl was the sound of a wolf fully transformed he dashed towards Lenny and his son bite Jaren broke from his bondage as Lenny turned his back to him the werewolf jumped out of the basement and confronted the police who shot at the beast as it struck and tear into them without mercy the more they shoot the more the beast struck them down for in truth they were no match for the beast and it got close to Nora it grabbed her by the throat her feet dangling off the ground but something surprising occurred another werewolf appeared from nowhere and came to her rescue as both beasts begin to attack one another the fight was fierce with either not wanting to back down but eventually the new wolf overcame Anton and ripped his head off his body and he died as their eyes meet Nora knew who this new werewolf was as she calls out Lenny's name but a good werewolf fled the scene leaving Nora behind in the woods father and son lived peacefully as Nora discovered Les Phillips body and found evidence that exonerated Lenny Griffith from all the murders as Lenny teaches his son Jaren how to be a good werewolf